For two years, tow truck drivers from around the country have gathered in Joliet, Illinois for the annual Tow Trucks for Tots Parade. This record-setting group holds the Guinness World Record for the most tow trucks in a parade. But they aren't just here for the parade, oh no. Inside of each truck is a sack of toys destined to brighten up a child's Christmas. We started Tow Trucks for Tots um, because we saw a need to collect toys for children and we decided we wanted to have a tow truck parade and we wanted to be able to do something for the community so we said we'd collect toys. That was our number one goal, to collect toys for children. The Illinois State Police started with the first Toes for Tots last year. I think the, uh, the numbers that attended well, exceeded everyone's expectation. It's a wonderful event that's associated with uh, Toys for Tots to get toys for kids who might not receive them during the holiday season. It's a wonderful event. Uh, it just shows the good heartedness and the, the generosity of these numerous entrepreneurs here. And again, it seems like they're going to exceed their expectations this year and it'll be even larger and raise more for the community. I did bring the most toys last year. We collected 376 last year, which was an amazing amount for us. Um, I thought we were definitely going to be beaten, and we weren't, and that was, it was a great accomplishment for us. Uh, this year we went out with the same goal, to get as many toys as we can for the 2009 parade. We wound up collecting this year 496 toys. We're just uh, glad to be here, enjoying it. We're all out here for the kids, and uh, it's a joyful event. and. Um, we're just having fun today. I just like collecting the toys, making sure children that normally would not have a Christmas are having a Christmas. And it, it's just a lot of fun. We have fun collecting them, but it's more of the giving that just, it just gives you a good special feeling inside. The most important part is that we are collecting toys for tots. For the, uh, for the Marines, it's going to stay in the Chicagoland area, and that by far is the, the, the greatest thing that we're doing. So we've, we've made a record, but we've collected toys, and I hope, that, I hope that we make a record doing that as well. And with that goal in mind, the drivers make the 45-mile journey carrying thousands of toys from Caterpillar Joliet to Toyota Park in Bridgeview, Illinois, all in an effort to bring much-needed toys to very deserving boys and girls. Leading the parade this year was, was the best thing I've done in a very long time. It's, it was so great to be out front. Everyone sees my truck nicely decorated with my toy box on the back, uh, the signage board on the back. Everyone's like, hey, they brought the most toys. To get a little bit of recognition to our company, um, and then just to be out there in the front, you know, you're the, you're the first truck anybody sees. And have everybody wave to you, and you can honk their horn back, little kids are waving back to you. And I had, a Santa, I had Santa Claus with me this year, which was great. Everybody was waving to Santa, saying hi to them. So it, it was a great feeling. It's been a great day. It's 70 degrees outside. It's sunny. It's Chicago. It's November. Who would have thought? Hey, it's a great thing to have. Another owner of a towing company said, you know, gosh, this is the greatest thing. He says, my guys weren't real involved in the towing industry. They went out and they towed cars, but by being in the parade, they washed, they waxed their trucks, they really, you know, got them all dialed up. They took a lot of pride in, in, in getting the trucks ready for their parade. And he says, my, guy, my guys talk about it all year long, you know, about the Tow Trucks for Tots parade. And uh, they look forward to it. Best decorated car carrier. Boy, this was a real surprise, a real shock. Girls boy, boy, my God. Great job. The decorations, everything was built by hand. Uh, we put it all together and decorated it. it. Took quite some time, and this year we decorated it more than last year. It's a group effort, a lot of work, a lot of stress, but we got it done. We did have a fundraiser to raise uh, money for toys and things like that too, so. Yeah, the decorations, you know, we want to have fun with it, you know, and it's for the kids. Best, de best decorated light duty. I hate to say this again, but uh, Girls Point, come on up again. Come on, guys. Hell of a job. Hell of a job.
And this will be for the, uh, for the towing company that traveled the furthest distance to come to our event. This will be Anderson Towing from Grand, Grand Myers, Wisconsin. 477 miles. Yeah, hey there. Go Brett Favre. The uh, company that brought the most tow trucks will be this company, will be O'Hare Towing, two years in a row. Thank you very much. 18 trucks. And we got a group picture for O'Hare. Come on up, all you guys are from O'Hare. This is probably the nearest one of all. Um, this is going to be for the company that collected the most toys. And, and of course, the company last year was Chariot Towing. They got to lead the parade. The, the person that will lead the parade next year will be Wildwood Service. 585 toys. Looking for weekly. Five hundred eighty-five toys. One of the best parts is that these people give up a day that they have to be off of work and they bring their trucks out and it's quite an expense for them, but it's all for a good cause and that's why we do it. About $1,800 I think it was in uh, toys that we brought down. Um, it's a pretty neat experience looking around and seeing all these tow trucks. A little bit of history and uh, showing a uh, different side than we're used to seeing in tow trucks. Uh, the helping side and the giving side. It's pretty neat. I think my favorite part about it is the end result when we get down to Toyota Park and we gather up all those toys and uh, the Boy Scouts help us with that. And we put them all in the trucks and we see those big huge amounts of, of toys that we gather up for the little kids. And the best thing about tow trucks for tots is that it happens every year. If you'd like to help us with our mission to brighten a child's Christmas, Contact Worldwide Equipment Sales. We will see you next year. I appreciate everyone coming out and supporting Coach Trucks for Tots, and you know, hopefully every year that we'll, you know, like I said, continue to grow and and continue to break the Guinness Book of World Records. And again, thanks for everybody who participated, who donated toys or monetarily or just showed up. We appreciate everything you guys have done and just want to say thanks again. So we would like to thank all of our sponsors, especially Toyota Park, you know, the Empress Casino, which hosted us last year, Caterpillar Plant that hosted us this year, you know, the Jordan Corporation, um, all the tours that helped us, all the other sponsors. They can go to our website at newtowtrucks.com, or excuse me, at towtrucksfortots.com and uh, see all the sponsors that helped us out and, and they, boy, there's just a ton of them and, and they, we really appreciate each and everything that they do for us. Because without them, we couldn't do it. Correct. And with all of our volunteers and, you know, to everybody who's ever, you know, came out and helped us any way, shape or form, if we've left you out, you know, we just want to say thank you. We didn't want to leave anyone out, so without you, it's not possible, so thank you.